Hey everybody, Nathan Mitchell here, Mitchell Defense. I'm the owner. Um, here to talk to you about how an AR actually works so that we can further explain in other videos why it's important to pay attention to the parts that are being put into your rifle. So, first things first, this is our MD-15, our carbon fiber. There is normally a handguard there. I've taken it off just to show you some of the parts. So, what we're looking at here, you have your gas block, your gas tube, your bolt carrier group, and this is the bolt, the, the end part down here. You have a buffer and your buffer spring. So, what happens whenever you fire this rifle, it goes bang, bullet goes out the barrel, gas from the barrel returns through the gas tube, goes into the gas key, fires the bolt carrier group backwards, goes into your buffer tube, goes forward, grabs another round out of your magazine, and rechambers another round. Uh, so some of the moving parts that are going on in that, obviously you have your bolt carrier, and then you have your bolt right here. Your bolt locks in and out inside your barrel. So these are things that are happening inside this rifle that need to have great coatings, great machining, because for reliability, these are the things that have to work. Another thing you gotta pay attention to, another moving part in this is your bolt or your buffer and your spring. So what happens is this is compressed down here and hangs out in your buffer tube. Um, whenever it's fired, this grabs the bolt carrier group, slows it down, and then propels it forward to grab another round and chamber it. So that's the basics of how an AR works. Um, other videos, we're gonna talk about the parts and why you should really pay attention to what parts are actually in it.